My name is Matt Curtis. I do the Everyman poems. They're poems taken from the Everyman perspective. This is Everyman's agnosticism. Dear Lord Jesus, would you come back now? Because I don't believe in you anymore. If you were to show up, say, while well, I was smoking a Newport after work, some spectacle in the sky like the 4th of July, I'd probably reconvert. To tell you the truth, first I'd go to a psychologist. But if you did it while I was in his office, a speaking, flaming Prozac advertisement, you'd have me, no questions asked. About a story in the book you wrote, or so they say, David and Goliath, I've seen some Davids take on Goliath, the math club president and the quarterback, and in that divine moment where all is well, and it looks like David is about to win, like a house cat latched on the back of a bear, it's right about the time Goliath throws the southern hook that lays David flat. And I know what you'll say. David had a slingshot. So with the advent of handguns, how many Davids are now daisies at the Eddyville State Penitentiary? Where were you my 18th birthday? We had a tap, an infinity of water, but we had no wine. We wanted wine. If you're the savior and all, you could have saved my party. Brought some hot girls, Samaritans, or Sodomites. We didn't care. We just wanted hot girls. They say you can heal the blind. You should fix my ex-girlfriend's eyes. You should see the piano teeth, coyote face, stumpy guy she dates now. She at least needs a good optometrist. I am in dire need of results if I am to be faithful. All I ask, dear, stupendous, great, awesome Lord Jesus is that you descend from the skies and pay my overdraft fees. To pay that much money would be miraculous, a clear act of omnipotence. I would be the first in the pew and the last out, each and every Sunday, from the day I receive my bank statement to the day I die. No doubt. And that phrase, no doubt, it says a lot for an agnostic. You can turn it off. <laughs>